So, my first participant, Abhishek Kumar from Honeybee Pollination and Pesticide Control. So, welcome to the show, Abhishek. My project, Zero Size Pesticides. Uh, in this, this is related to agriculture and uh, in agriculture farmers are basically having two problems. One is crop productivity and second is pesticides. So, the project name is zero size pesticides. Here we are doing having two solutions, one is for crop productivity which we are doing by honey bee pollination where we have seen the increase in productivity of vegetables and various crops from 27 percent to 60 percent. The next major issue is pesticides. These days what is happening that farmers are using lots of pesticides. If they are been asked to only go for 1 milligram pesticides, they are putting 1 kg of pesticides. Our idea is to control the pesticides also and increase the productivity also. So, here what we are doing is we are tied up with the various corporates who are doing contract farming, where they do a lot of investment on around 5 to 10 crores a year only on the pesticide testing. So, our idea was to tie up with them and give our services how to control the pesticides first. So, this was used by bio pesticides there are so many insects, this is called e chemical ecology. So, there are important insects which will, which, which feed this, which uh, these pests are the feed for these insects okay. and these are scientifically uh, executed on the farms. So, this we are doing with the help of NBAIR Bangalore, who are having these products and we are going to license this second part is for crop productivity and that is done by honey bee pollination. So, how both are correlated? If my farmer is going to use a lot of pesticide, my bees will die. So, I am asking them, I do not want honey from those boxes, you keep the boxes with you, you take the honey, but follow our instructions scientifically in each one acre land use two bees, two honey bees hives and this the area what we measure, we see that how the crop productivity will increase. So, this meanwhile we are our target clients are only the contract farmers at present, but in future we are going with three T's that is training testing and trading. What are so you here? You are a product or a service? I am a service provider. Service provider. So, what do you supply? Suppose I have 10 acres of uh, paddy field. Mm -hmm. What What do you supply to me? I How will not supply money? you anything. Okay. I am providing my, my services to the corporates and farmers. Okay. I am a farmer. Okay. You are a farmer. Pa paddy. Yeah. No, 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 no. I am not for paddy, first okay, of all. For what this is for? all for horticulture products. Okay which can be honeybee can be used for the increasing the productivity okay. via pollination. Okay. So, you come and educate me that I need to or you yeah. give me any what are the services you give me? At present, um, I am giving the services to the only the corporates who are having the contract farming. Okay. They are associated to you. Okay. So, I am going to them because they provide you seed everything to you. Okay. So, I providing the service that this is honeybee pollination, you increase your productivity. Okay. Okay. So, this is the one productivity increase. So, per acre we charge some amount depending on the field and how much resource we will be putting there. So, how do you actually cultivate honey bees? We do not cultivate honey bees, we are having the boxes. Okay. So, this this has to be placed in the farm okay. Okay. and during the flowering season we have to put it from which fruits will be coming. So, the idea is, is that because uh, in our environment nature, this honey bees are reducing a lot. No, that I know here. How yeah. do you increase honey bees is my question. See, I, I We are not increasing honey bees, uh -huh. we are increasing the crop productivity. crop productivity. What is the implementation mechanism? I think there is a bit of a confusion as to what exactly is the service that you provide. Yeah. 
see I, we have a scientific team okay through which by a honey bee pollination we are increasing the productivity that is the one service there is a process to how to place the bee farm at their one acre land okay and we are doing all the documentation that how, during the flowering season how the it will be converted to fruits okay now the no, thing i just want you to focus on just that honey bee box here hmm. what do you physically do do you just advise farmers to no no do, no uh, we provide the honey bee box correct so what happens with that box we are placing in the farm okay okay and this is put up very scientifically okay okay in the flowering season and the days should not vary okay then this bees work out bees do their so work understand. so basically the ser service that you are providing is you are providing those boxes, boxes. and the know how of yes. where to place them yeah. and when to place them and that them. is in our supervision yes not under farmers okay understand so you are you are basically going telling your corporates that you have let's say 300 farmers who are working for you hmm. let me take a bunch of 50 farmers and i'm going to implement my methodology for crop productivity increase and pesticide reduction yeah. and over a six month period here is the result sure. that i'm going yeah. to accomplish for you mm. yeah. and i'm going to you know charge you a fee for that fee for that. and these uh, four centers is where you have your research teams yes and you also have the local network local. for providing those services yes yes okay okay now we understood how do you make money or how are you i understood you mm. charge a, f a mm. fee how are you i mean uh, what is the volume that you have done so far I meant like how much do you charge per acre or? Per acre we charge depending on the product again, if okay. it is a pomegranate. So we depending on our like it is showing 27 percent increase in the productivity, what we have done the small research. So we propose that uh, on the productivity there is a percentage. Okay. Okay. So okay. High, okay, fair enough. And uh, so if you already have those four centers, right? Um, and how long have you been in operation Abhishek? I have been for 2 years. 2 years. Huh? So, you have those 4 centers which means that you must have customers you know in those nearby centers and since it is a service business it is not very capital intensive. Uh, what are you really looking for? I mean see what is happened now that while doing this work we have got certain projects from Europe and their requirement is for the cosmetic m medicinal plants flowers again. So, they, they, that is a huge requirement coming up mm. where we were associated with the scientist on the consulting basis. I was not paying the salary to them. So, now the issue is that we have to pay a, we should have a team, proper team whom we can that is the investment is required. With some basic funding. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Okay, you have documented success stories with those four centers mm -hmm. like can you give in each center 10 farmers that have used your service and that are happy no no uh, we can give you like uh, corporates whom the we have done corporates okay yeah okay so hyderabad we have done yeah okay. okay can you name one customer customer is indena 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 okay. indena is again a european company but okay. they are based in bangalore itself okay how do you monitor their revenues and uh, how do you monitor your activities from the field do we you have any uh, uh, go with the revenue of the company we ah, yeah. claim that this is the 27 percent increase in the productivity suppose yeah okay and what is the market value of pomegranate okay, okay. on that basis we propose the uh, what is the price but again if suppose there is a contract been made between company so if suppose that it is not been executed properly but we have invested our resources yes yes right ah. so there is a minimum thing like 50000 to 1 lakh rupees that's a minimum fee minimum fee okay and again that how we work how frequently you monitor is it a daily based or a weekly based no no it's a, it's a monthly to twice the idea you currently make profits in the company they i'm not i'm sure you're not making any profit you see uh, in this project yes for the testing part we are making the profit where we do the pesticide testings and the, we are outsourcing to the laboratory how will reduce the pest control pest thing? control is done by chemical ecology it's a science called there are certain insects which will eat away the pests which has been developed by nbair bangalore, bangalore.